Let's have a look at question three. It's 10L, page 464. A ladder four meters long rests against a vertical wall. If the bottom of the ladder slides away from the wall at 1.5 meters per second, find how fast the angle between this ladder and this wall will be changing when this angle is pi on three radians. So we constructed a diagram here. This is the ladder. That's the wall. So that's the ladder against the wall. That's the angle we're interested in. Remember, it's defined as the angle between the ladder and the wall, that one. We're going to call this x. If the bottom of the ladder slides away from the wall, that's the variable there. Okay, so the ladder is sliding away from the wall. So we set up our equation here. We've got, the, the question was, uh, find how fast the angle between this ladder and this wall will be changing. So that's d theta dt. Now they gave us dx dt because that was the, the ladder sliding away from the wall at 1.5 meters per second. So we know that. What we need to find is the relationship between theta and x. Well, we can do that because we know that sine theta is x on four. So x is four sine theta. And now here we wanted to theta the x, but we have our expression here in terms of uh, x in terms of sine theta. So we do dx to theta, well that's four cosine theta. Okay, so now we've got dx to theta. Well, we needed to theta dx. Okay, so let's see what we do with that. Now, d theta to t, that's what we're after, is equal to d theta dx. So we're gonna flip this thing up the other way and put one over four cosine theta to represent d theta dx. dx dt was given here as 1.5. So our expression for d theta dt is d theta dx, which is one over four cosine theta, because that's dx d theta, times dx dt, which was given. All right, and then they asked for this to find out at theta equals, uh, find the rate at theta equals pi on three. Well, we're gonna do d theta dt is equal to one over four cosine pi on three times 1.5. And that equals one over four times the cosine of, that's 60 degrees, the cosine of 60 is a half. So one over four times a half times 1.5, and that equals 0.75 radians per second. That's the rate that the angle is changing.